Her son tells us she did live at the Legacy Co Legends condominium complex right there and was likely going to the Walgreens across the street that night. The 75 year old moved to the valley in August from Utah. She came following the death of her husband in February and to be closer to her biological children and grandchildren who live here. Whitehead was a retired lieutenant from the Weber County Sheriff's Office, a place about 30 miles north of Salt Lake City. Her family says she became the first female lieutenant in the state. The sheriff's office posted a tribute on their Facebook page to her. Whitehead's children recall her passion for helping others and caring about her family. That's all her focus was on was grand, the grandkids. She wasn't in great health when she passed away, but that's the one thing that she wanted to see happen was that her grandkids are set up for the next stage of their life. Henderson police say one car stopped when Whitehead started to cross the street, but the other didn't see her. A preliminary investigation shows alcohol and speed are not factors in the crash. And coming up at 6, we'll have more on Whitehead's legacy in law enforcement and what her family says they'll remember most about her. Reporting live, Kristen Drummond, 8 News Now. And a man is dead after a North Las Vegas motorcycle crash. This happened around 4 a.m. near Craig and Lamb. Police say a 53-year-old motorcyclist was stopped at a red light there when an Acura car rear-ended him. The motorcyclist was taken to the hospital where he later died. The driver of that car drove away from the scene. North Las Vegas police are still searching for this person. If you have any information, call Crime Stoppers.